Let's take a look at the political landscape in these legislative elections. With polarization and discontent in the country ahead of the election of representative to the Senate and the Chamber of Deputies, the main political forces in Colombia aspiring to win a majority vote in the Congress are divided into three coalitions. This would lay out the field for the upcoming presidential elections in May 29th. On the left side of the spectrum, the PACT Historical Coalition proposes deep changes in healthcare and in the structure of the monetary system to fight against the impact of pandemics in trade and market flow, as well as to ease the challenges inflation poses, most of all, for the low and middle class, have faced the growing tide of inequality and lack of government support. Meanwhile, the coalition Centro Esperanza is being deemed as a central alignment, focusing more on issues like normalization of a basic rent fee and a reduction of corrupt practices. The right-wing coalition, known as Centro Democratico, with support from the military and public law enforcement bodies, is fixed at maintaining a continuity of the current government's plan of action, a firm follower of former President Álvaro Uribe's policy standards.